Hello and welcome back to NEET Decoded. Hope you have gone through the previous videos of the NEET MCQ series. And in this video, we'll study about insulin structure by discussing a NEET question. So let's start. The question is, which of the following statements is not correct? Options one, in man, insulin is synthesized as a pro-insulin. Two, the pro-insulin has an extra peptide called C-peptide. The functional insulin has A and B chains linked together by hydrogen bonds. And option four, genetically engineered insulin is produced in E. coli. Now, insulin is synthesized through the process of uh, genetic engineering. And here you can see the insulin structure where uh, you can see the A and B chains and there is an extra C chain or C peptide which is uh, removed and uh, in the final product, the mature insulin structure, the C chain is or the C peptide is removed and both the chains are linked through disulfide bonds. Here the disulfide bonds is visible. All right. So the human insulin uh, comprises of two polypeptide chains, as you have already seen, chain A and chain B. And the genes for these chains are inserted into plasmid vectors when insulin is genetically engineered or synthesized through genetic engineering. So the genes are then inserted into plasmid vectors of E. coli. So the recombinant DNA is formed and this recombinant bacteria is allowed to multiply in a suitable nutrient media. From here, the A and B insulin chains are extracted, purified, and combined through disulfide bonds. You can see the procedure, how here you can see how the DNA has been extracted and it is inserted into the plasmid. And this recombinant DNA is then inserted into E. coli bacterium, which is allowed to multiply in a fermentation tank or in a suitable nutrient media and then insulin is extracted for commercial use. So now in mammals and humans insulin is synthesized as a pro-hormone and uh, this has an extra stretch the C-peptide as already discussed which is attached to the uh, insulin that is produced which is actually the pro-insulin the pro-hormone or pro-insulin and during maturation, the C peptide is removed, right? So how the procedure is done, you can see here in the sequential order, here DNA is inserted into the plasmid and the recombinant uh, DNA is now inserted into the suitable host, which is E. coli, and it is allowed to multiply and then insulin is isolated here. So coming back to the question, that is which of the statements is not correct. So the option would be option number three, the functional insulin has A and B chains linked together by hydrogen bonds. So the bonds are not hydrogen bonds. These are disulfide bonds, right? So please like, share and subscribe to my channel for regular updates on any biology content. And for PCB and PCM students, you have uh, brigadme.com where you can log in for MCQ practice. Thanks for watching.